Hey there, good evening, it's Ann C coming at you. And before I dive into my topic at hand, is to go to ansiegmentor.com. You can join my private leadership community. We go through leadership uh, business development books together. And this particular month, we're going through Simon Sinek's book called Leaders Eat Last. All right, so go to ansiegmentor.com and join me there. So let's get into the topic at hand. Um, this is especially pertinent or relevant to people who have a a company for what you are providing goods and services and you are wanting to increase your sales um, that's my expertise is sales and marketing and I love it it's so much fun all right so we just came off a three-day workshop in actuality it was a four-day we had one of our high-level mentorship workshops stacked on top of it so it was a full four days okay so what we do and how I shifted things, I did a little bit of testing our last event, which by the way, let me just share with you. We have used sales teams in the past. Our challenge with that model is it's, ex it's so hard to get a group that can match your culture and your brand. I, I have tried it numerous times and it's, you know, they'll talk the talk and then Nope, they just don't match your culture and your brand. Or This has been the case for me. And our culture and brand is everything to us. We're an education company that's been through the e-commerce business school. And we want a very specific uh, type of experience for our members. And some people get that and other people don't. The best who get it are those who are groomed up inside our community and they understand and appreciate um, that, you know what, I've got this little gripper on my stand is gripping the mute. There we go. Maybe, okay, I didn't want my volume being affected. I hope that there's no challenge here. Anyways, um, so that's just a little side note that I prefer to have my own internal sales team. You know, I wish I could offset and have someone else do it. I wish I could have a Facebook ad team. Uh, no. It, it seems we just have to take things internal because we know our offers, we know our culture, we know our brand, we have better control and management, and nobody cares for your company more than yourself. So that's been for both sales teams and advertising teams. It just seems we have to take it internal, and our results are far, far better when we do it ourselves internal. So that's my little rant on that. Okay, um, so what we did is um, our last, our previous event was in March in Dallas, and we did a buddy system. So as one of my, my top sales folks, she's our, my business advisor, and then I buddied up with her. Now, grant you, I realize in that context, it's like a consult with the owner of the company. So I know that changes the sales dynamic significantly. But even still, um, I've worked my gal and I worked absolutely flawlessly together this past weekend. And that is that we give people the opportunity to have a consultation and then to give them uh, the ability to upgrade and receive a discount and a special offer that we're hosting during the workshop. And so we did that and we had a, our conversion rate was about 80, it's seven divided by eight. So 88% or so. Um, it just went absolutely spectacularly well and um, once she grew up inside my system she has been a subscriber of mine for about 10 years so she knows my culture and my brand and how to represent my brand and how we the brand is really mostly about how we treat people that's really what the brand is a lot of around preserving the dignity of people as we work with them through their educational learning process and so all to say um, we buddied up two people doing a sales consult and it just went extremely well and such that I now have the opportunity to, um, I'm partnering up with someone from a financial institution in my local area and uh, be starting to do live workshops in this region and then expand out uh, up into Missouri, et cetera. And just, um, it's going to be a lot of fun. And so I'm going to probably fly her out to join me with this as we do these um, presentations through a financial institution uh, through my company in association with my company and then be this, this buddy sales team. So 
Um, again, this is for people who do sales and marketing. They've got goods, products, and services that they're wanting to market. And we, we use consultative selling. It's what I was trained on 15 years ago. It's a superior form of communication. Perhaps I'll do a series on that. I just love that topic so much. Um, and it's so highly, incredibly effective when used really well. So um, that's what I want to share with you. One of my big takeaways, I've got a big, huge stack of fun takeaways for my workshop because I always like to observe the whole ecosystem of it, what worked, what didn't work, what would we do differently, and um, just everything involved with it. It's, it's so much fun and such a blast. So do me a favor. If you're watching the recording of this, write in hashtag replay. And then uh, also go to ansigmentor.com uh, where you can join my private leadership community. But also I am available as a sales and marketing consultant. My expertise is building really strong and powerful teams that work in unison like a well-oiled machine. Um, that's, that's probably my top capability and something that I love very dearly is building really strong teams of people that work seamlessly together. No birds under the saddle, no drama. It's just, we just go in there and do the deal and get the work done just like we did with our workshop. So if you are needing coaching or consulting for your business, whether that be on the sales and marketing side, the leadership team development side, um, structuring your offers, uh, this is what I've been doing for 15 years. So uh, feel free to reach out to me through private message and I'll be happy to get on the phone with you, do an initial consult and see if we might be a good fit for each other. So I'll be sharing some sub subsequent Facebook lives about more tips and strategies as it relates to conducting, whether that's events, workshops, or retreats. We do all three in my company and they're all a very different type of event. So maybe I'll break that down in my next Facebook Live and explain those details to you. So again, go to ansigmentor.com. Thanks so much for listening. We'll be talking soon. Bye-bye.